Today, many companies are moving to the cloud, like a public cloud, private cloud, or an average cloud. So what is the different model services of this concept? Let's discover this together. Cloud computing supports three types of services model, based on infrastructure and application support or access to the user. These are generic to all public cloud vendor and private cloud, such as infrastructure as a services, platform as a services, software as a services. With the Google Cloud Platform, we provide five types of services model that include the three generic one, that is infrastructure as a services, platform as a services, software as a services, a function, and a container as a services. SSIS or Software as a Services is a high level of cloud services in which users are not aware about cloud provide software or tool used in this process. Everything is hidden from the user and he is supposed to use cloud-based app over the internet. SSIS is as you go services means setup is already and services are running. You just need to pay and start using them. No wait time and no configuration time. For example, a Gmail, Google Drive and etc. Pass or platform as a services is a function at lower level than SSIS. Typically providing a platform which software can be developed and deployed. Pass provide abstract much of the work of the dealing with server and giving client an environment which the operating system and server software as well as underlying server hardware and network infrastructure are taking care of them leaving user free to focus on the business side of scalability and the application development of their product or services example a web hosting container as a services is a set of application file dependency and configuration needed for the runtime environment baseline os or software or hardware is completely abstract. Container as a services is one of a new kind of cloud services and is available with a few vendor and similar to paths. Virtualized container are provided and customer complete framework and environment to custom to develop application. Customer need no worry about deployment and integration into hosting environment. Google Container as a Services is a built on a open source Kubernetes system. Kubernetes give you the option of working on Google Cloud Platform, on-premise, private and hybrid cloud. Function as a Services is a serverless cloud services. You can develop your single purpose function using Node.js, Python, Java, and attach them to the event. Once the event occurs, the function will be executed on managed environment. And you don't need to worry about underlying hardware and software. This is typically used when deploying microservices application, webhook, IoT and this is the uh, most popular uses of function as a services. Infrastructure as a services is a bottom line supported by any cloud. Infrastructure is building plugin for any environment. In ES, computing solution and storage over the cloud is managed and provisioned automatically. In other term, cloud provide rent their service in ES. User need to pay based on their usage on infrastructure. Users are free to use OS and software based on their requirement. They need no worry about hardware and data center management. For example, Google Cloud Platform VMs to deploy application and database. This table shows us the, the difference between all services. For ES is used to moving existing system on another system, for example, a Google Cloud Engine. The advantages is pay per user, scalability. The disadvantages is data security, vendor dependency, infrastructure term will be owned by the manager. But for the uh, platform as a services, is used to 
web facing application like google app engine the advantages is highly scalable easy to migrate to reduce the time of the development the disadvantages is the vendor dependency and the data security the container as a service is, is used to running on a multiple environment like on a cloud on premise and hybrid cloud for example kubernetes the advantages is a multi-environment support fast and simple with the preload app configuration the disadvantages applicable for limit application poor management and lead for over bj a function as a services is an event triggered the advantages is scalability fast and simple pay only when the function is running the disadvantages is vendor lock-in the SaaS is advantages of the SaaS is low cost quickly configuration web-based access scalability and the disadvantages is infrastructure is hidden limited customer possibility so in this session we have seen the different type of services cloud and the difference between each services thank you for watching